Alright, so the joys of tiling or removing, removing tiles, that's a two-part process. Just like whenever you put it in, you get tiled and grout. Well, when you take it up, you gotta get the tile, then the thin set. I've posted a couple of videos on how to get up some tile. Now let's do one about thin set and some of the easiest ways to go about it. So this is, if, if you're doing a big area, then a demo hammer with a thin set remover blade is the way to go. Now, uh, for me, we use this bathroom, we use this shower. Um, I don't really want to get it dusty in here. So here's a great dust free way. Um, I would only do it in smaller areas like this bathroom. So you have a couple options. We have floor scrapers. Um, these are great. You can put the whole body weight on them. The blade on these is not going to be as sharp. Come on now. I'd say a handheld one. So this handheld one's blade is bringing the heat. So let's give this one a whirl. So these handheld blades are by far the way that I like to go. Now, we just sit down, hang out, put on some music if we want, and we get after it with this. What we will want is water. And we will want the ground. And I'm just going to drop it all around down here. And I'm going to let it sit for a little bit. Just kind of sop some of it up. talking down to the bare concrete so um, this is the way to go I've done many tile floors and uh, definitely if you got a smaller area easy peasy best way all right so here we go got all that just got this little section left water's been sitting on there probably almost five minutes seems like the more or the longer you get it to sit the better to be honest with you take my towel I mean, buddy boy. If you aren't taking a tile thin set mortar this way, then you're just not doing it right. You're really just wasting a whole lot of your time and your energy. Buddy.